Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name's Reckless Riley, and today I'm going to be talking about Halo Master Chief Collection. Now, as a lot of people know, it's coming out in under a freaking month, which means I'm super pumped for it. And today they announced that the game has gone gold. Oh yeah, which means it's completely done. It's completely done being designed. Everything along those lines is done. There's going to be no major changes to the game from now until launch. But that also comes with the news that there's going to be a 20 gigabyte download update on day one. Now, this is uh, a little bigger than most patches are, and that is for the reason that it's basically adding a whole bunch of multiplayer content that they weren't able to fit onto the 45 gigabyte disc. Now, when you buy the disc and you don't want download that update, you're still able to play all the single player things, but without this update, you're not able to play a lot of the multiplayer features. And if you have internet, you're able to download this update. So I guess it kind of makes sense that they'd make all the multiplayer uh, features a, an update. But it's it's still quite a question uh, as to why they didn't do uh, two discs. And the answer to that that was answered today was they didn't want to do it the same way they did with Halo 4 where the things weren't unified. If you go to the campaign in Halo 4, you'll see that you're not able to record clips from your campaign because the game is separated because of that disc to digital by having two discs. So instead of doing that, what they wanted to do is make it all unified. So instead they're doing this update patch and they're making it so that it's only multiplayer content that you're downloading. So if you're playing this game and you have internet, you're able to download it. And if you don't have internet, you're still able to play all the features that you would if you didn't have internet in the first place. So I'm, I think that this is a really, really good idea to keep the game completely unified. And also what they're doing is they're making it so that people who are buying it digitally are able to download the patch beforehand. So they'll have the entire game ready at midnight when it releases. I am not thinking that this is a bad thing, nor is it like an amazing thing because it's, it's a little bit of an inconvenience for the people with limited bandwidth. But it's an interesting idea, and I'm glad that they're keeping the entire game, the entire interface, everything together, and they don't want to separate anything or cut any features. So I'm really happy for that. But what are your thoughts on this? Is this an inconvenience to you, or do you think that this is just awesome, that they're keeping the entire game together, or do you think that you, they should have just gone with some sort of tube disc something? Anyway, guys, I'm Reckless Riley, and I hope you enjoyed the video. So I'll see you guys later, and hopefully with some Halo Master Chief Collection content. Anyway, I'm Reckless Riley, as I just said two seconds ago, and I'll see you guys later.